Good morning, Internet. This is Alex the Sudokus, and it is Thursday, the 3rd of September 2020. And we have another hard New York Times Sudoku for you today. Um, let's get right on it. Let's see. So, we're going to do some Snyder notations, um, starting with the ones all the way up to nine, um, where we pencil mark in. Um, any cages with a number that only has two candidates. So, for instance, the two ones gives us a pair of ones over here. These twos and that two gives us a pair of twos there. Um, anything else? Do, 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 do. Um, let's see, these twos and that two gives us a pair of twos here either. And I think that's it. So what about threes? We have a pair of threes here. Thanks to these two threes and these two threes also gives us a pair of threes over there. Um, that looks to be it. So what about fours? Oops. We have a confirmed four over there. Thanks to these two fours and that four, which creates another pair of fours up here. And let's see. Do, 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 do. Yep, that looks like it. So let's move on to five. So we have a five here, thanks to that five and that five. That gives us a triple area here, and I can see a one seeing into that cell, a seven seeing into that, and the eight remaining in all three cells. So let's leave it as that and continue on with the fives. Um, these two fives gives us a pair of fives here, which creates a pair of matching threes and fives, knocking a two out of the corner cell. So the two now has to go there. And the two, working in tandem with that one, locks a pair of twos over there. Um, let's see, have we got anything else happening here? Uh, nope, so let's go back to the fives. And let's see, can we do more with these fives? Not that I can see, so what about sixes? Sixes... Um, the two sixes don't interact very well, but that six locks the two cells. I've got matching pairs of threes and fives, which means the sixes have to go there, because the six can't go in the matching pairs. And this pointer pair of six Locks a pair of sixes up here as well, thanks to that six. So now I have a matching two six pair, which is great because in this column, I only have two cells left to play. And let's see, I've got one and eight. Ah, but we can't actually place either of them yet. Okay, so what more can we do? Um, nothing else on sixes. Let's look at sevens. Was these two sevens locks a pair of sevens here, thanks to the two and six blocking that cell. But I also have a seven down here anyway. Um, let's see, seven, seven, seven. That looks to be it for the sevens. So let's look at the eights. Eights. Um, no action on the eights. So let's look at the nines then. These two nines. Locks a pair of nines there, because that is a 3-5 cell, which is out of play. Um, let's see. These two nines locks a pair of nines over there, which in turn gives us another pair of nines up there as a pointed pair. Um, I think that's all we've got. So let's do a bit of a, an evaluation. Have we got any weak areas that have developed? Um, we do have weak area here, but we can't do anything with it. Um, let's expand a little bit and look at quadruple cells as well as um, the triples, because I don't think we have any triples left. So, I've got anything on, in this cage, we're missing one, f 
five, six, seven, eight, eight. Nope, nothing going on there. Still can't see the eight in that. We've got five cells remaining here, so let's ignore that. So, not much progress here. Let's do another round of um, notations from one to nine. And I can see that one and the pointer pair of ones also locks a pair of ones over here. Um, let's see, I also have a pair of ones here, thanks to that one and the pointer pair of ones over here. I should have seen that earlier at the start, but I missed it. Um, that has an effect of locking the ones in column seven and nine in these two cages. So the one has to be in column eight in the bottom cage and that generates a one six matching pair forcing the nine out so now the nine has to go there and that locks a pair of nines over there and i think that's all i can do with it so can we do anything else with the one do, 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 do. not that i can see so let's move on to twos twos can we do anything else with the twos? Uh, can't see anything, so what about threes? Uh, threes, still locked in there. Threes, nothing happening. Fours, four, four. Four, 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 four. Nothing that I can see. Fives. Um, oh, actually, why don't I don't know why I didn't spot this um, when I locked the pair of ones and sixes and placed the nine. This is an eight, isn't it? So that's useful because that places the eight over there and it also places the eight in these two cells because of that eight and that eight. Um, can we do anything with that though? So we've got one, six here, and we've got seven, eight, and nine. Well, seven, eight, and nine are all placed in here. So that has to be a nine in that case. Yes, it is. So nine goes there. And um, what effect does that have? That knocks out a nine pencil marking over here. It also locks a pair of nines over here, but we have a nine down here. So that has to be the nine, which creates a pointer pair of nines over here, thanks to these three nines. And what about this nine? This nine doesn't establish anything for us. Um, okay, so we have a little bit of a weak area here. I know that's out of play as a one and eight on the column. So I still have four numbers left, which are one, three, four, and one, three, four, and oh, one, three, four, and eight. Um, but that cell is out of play. In fact, that cell is out of play as well because I've got the one, four, and seven already locked in these three cells. So one, three, four, and eight. I've got four, eight, and one here. Seeing this cell, so that has to be a three now. So with that being a three, um, this can be, this is now one, three, four, and eight. So that has to be a four then. Yeah, because it has to be one, four, eight, and I can see one and eight. So that four locks a four over here, which resolves the seven and eight pair, which resolves the one and seven over here. Um, it locks an eight in that cell, resolving the one as well. And I think that's it over there. So now this cell has to be five or five or six in these two cells. So let's mark them in. And I think that's all I can do with that. So let's check these three cages. Uh, ones, twos, twos over here, no, threes. So threes, I've already got fours. I've got a pair of fours locked in here, thanks to these fours. Fives, um, no action on fives. Six, seven, eight. Eights are locked in here. And nine, okay, that's all we can do with it. 
So, anything else happening down here? Not that I can see. So, I've got a triple developing here. So, this is one, five, one, five, and six. So, let's see. I've got a one and a six here. So, that has to be a five then. So, that being a five, um, hmm, doesn't do anything for us. So, now I've got one and one and six. Uh, can't deduce them just yet, so let's leave them be, and I think we have another quadruple here, let's have a look at that as well. I have sneaky suspicion that 1, 3 and 5 are, yep, 1, 3 and 5 are part of the missing cells, so the only thing remaining is the 6, so that's a naked 6 over there, and if that's, if that's a 6, well, six are locked in columns four and five, and six locks this cell as well. In fact, yeah, that sees the six one pair, so that resolves it. So that's a one as well. And can we resolve the remaining one as well? No, we can't. So what about a six? Can we do anything with that? Well, locks a pair of sixes over here because of these two sixes. But I also have a six up there, so that six is resolvable. And that's it, that's all we can do. Uh, what are these now? These are threes and fives. Um, and I can't see either of them just yet. So what may be worth doing is another round of notations. Um, oh no, that's there's a three over here. So... Do, 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 do. Yeah, let's do another quick round of notations, because I don't think I can see anything else immediately. So, uh, do, 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 twos, threes, threes, threes are locked in, three cells, what about fours? Four, 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 okay, I've got that pair of fours over here, which doesn't give us anything. So, what about fives? Fives are locked in these cells, these cells. Um, hmm, we can't place the five either. Sixes, I think we've already looked at. What about sevens? Surely. We've got a pair of sevens over here, thanks to that seven and that seven. Um, <laughs> nothing else that I can do. What about eights? Eights. Eights are locked in these cells, so we have a two, eight, nine triple here, which means these are now threes and sevens. So I've got a seven here, so that has to be a seven and three, so that creates a four, five, six triple. Four, five, and six, and we can't tell any of them. So what about the three and the seven? Can they? give us anything, that gives us another pair of sevens over here, and also that seven locks out a seven over here, and locks another pair of sevens down there. So, with the triple, we are left with a quadruple of five, six, let's see, two, no, one, two, three, five, six, and, three, five, six, and seven, Three, five, six, and seven. I've got three and five here. Nothing on these yet, so no use for us. What about here? We have another triple. In fact, we have a pair there. Oh, that's the two, eight pair. Eight, nine pair. Two, nine, and two, nine, and three. Ah, oh, we can't resolve any of them. Disappointing. Um, I've got a quadruple here, which are three, two, three. Two, three, eight, and nine. Uh, I don't think we're going to resolve anything over here, um, but I spotted a pair of eights down here because eights can't go in that cell on the columns. So what were these again? These were oh, actually, yeah. And I have an eight down here, so actually eight only goes in here. Um, and eight is also locked in these two cells. Okay, so these are now fours and. Fours and oh, 
what is it, fours, fours and twos, I've got two down here, so that's got to be the two, and, sorry, four, and that's got to be the two, and a two resolves the six, two pair, and the six resolves the five, six pair, and that now locks the four and four and nine in here, and that has to be the four because of the nine over there, as well as, oh, it's not a four nine pair, but it has to be a four anyway because I have a four over here. Um, it's actually four and four and five. So five goes in here, which unlocks the three and five. And that five now locks the five over there because these two fives. And now five is locked up here. And with that, we've erased the other eight candidates, which unlocks the eight nine pair there. And the eight also unlocks the eight two and nine over here and um, we have a triple down here but more importantly here we have uh three and these are now sevens and sixes uh still can't resolve them just yet but we should be able to tell what this is or should we actually what's um what's in here one seven and one seven and three so three can't go in these two two cells so three is here seven is here which forces a seven there so six goes there six and one ah so this is a one actually which resolves the one and four up there and we are left with twos here and three there and that is today's hard new york times sudoku um i hope that's been useful um if that's helped you at all please like and subscribe for future videos as well um, otherwise, I shall see you tomorrow. Bye!